We, we love, love El Nido. You got first impressions of El Nido. Tick. Good morning, you guys, from our bike in El Nido. We are so excited. It's day one. We are exploring the town of El Nido. Let's see what this place has to offer. Are you ready? Woo -hoo -hoo. Look at the views. Good morning, all you beautiful people from a beautiful and sunny first day in El Nido. Come on, we are so excited. We're finally to be here. here, people. We've heard so much about El Nido. All of you guys have sent so many recommendations and suggestions. Yeah that we come to Palawan, we come to El Nido, check the place out. So, here we are. And El Nido has been on our list for so long. long. Yeah. Literally so long, so we are so excited to finally be here. We are just walking through the town. We have an exciting activity planned for this morning. We're gonna get to see a little bit more of El Nido, um, but we're gonna show you that in a minute. But we're gonna today just go around El Nido. We've got a bike, so we're just gonna have a little look, see what there is. Hopefully. Just trying to make sure we don't get run over as well. <laughs> First up of the day, we're going to turn right from where we are right now. This is where we're walking. And we're going to go and check out the beach first because it's good weather. So let's go check out the beach, which is right down here. Let's go. So you guys, we have come down to El Nido beachfront, like to the front of the town where it is on the beach. And we just come out on this little like pier um, which just stretches all the way out um, and we are just having a little wander around to see what El Nido is like and as you walk out to the edge of this pier look what like is right back in front of you this is stunning wow look at all of these like cliffs and the rock formation is just crazy wow this place is insanely beautiful like it is so 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 nice but guys it is absolutely beautiful down here oh my gosh they even have a little petrol station as well look we cannot wait to go out and get on one of the tours soon um that sounds like it's going to be so much fun so we are super excited for that um i think telsif is just going to fly the drone now so that will be fun so let's show you first the aerial shots of el nido The landscape down here is amazing. You guys can see how good it looks from up above when I put the drone up. It is gorgeous out here. It's a quaint little town and we love it. It's it so is, cute. Yeah, <laughs> it's it's gorgeous. Like the scenery here is amazing. Yeah. We're really excited to see what the next few days in El Nido have in store for us because if this is anything to go by, this is amazing. Really it's setting excited. a it's setting a really high precedent this, so uh, mm -hmm. excited. Wow you guys, so we are just walking up through the town. And there is the prettiest backdrop, firstly. Let me just show you that. That is so beautiful. But this is what I'm talking about, about a lot of construction going on. But there's so many like little souvenir shops. You can get your clothing shops. Another hotel that's opening up. There's lots of like little souvenirs along the side here as well. It's a proper quirky little town. There's a lot going on. You can tell like it's gonna pick up like the buzz the vibe yeah. it will definitely get busier and livelier at night i think yeah there's restaurants down here more shops down here there's more as you go up as well so many little cafes restaurants oh there's a bakery very popular bakery 
we've got another activity plan that's literally where we're headed right now. So come move, let's go! This one's called the Canopy Walk. That's what we're doing right now. So let's see the amazing views from up top and see what Nido looks like. Let's go. We're ready. We're helmeted up. We are harnessed up. And now we're ready to go do the canopy walk. You got a big head. Wow, it fits. So we are kitted up and ready to go. Fired up, ready to go. We are heading through here to go on a canopy walk to see the best view, maybe the best view of El Nido. This looks amazing. So even before we got to El Nido, we had absolutely no idea that the trademark down here in El Nido, among other things, is also the limestone cliffs. Like, wow, look at that. I don't know if you guys can see it, it from here, so but- It is so beautiful. This is literally like being in Jurassic Park. And they are the whole way as well. We're not quite sure what we've signed up to. Like I say, we think it's just a rope bridge um, and a swing. And of course, it doesn't miss any opportunity. Oh! <laughs> One, three. Go, girl! Oh! <laughs> Sorry, I've got a bit distracted there. Doesn't miss any opportunity. I wanted to shoot some hoops there. For a little bit of basketball. Can't miss a good little opportunity to shoot some hoops, so yeah. That kid was so cute. Tassel was like walking back to me after the first shot and he was like, hey, come do one more. <laughs> and then he was like, are you coming back? I was like, definitely after the tour. Yes. <laughs> so like David Attenborough, right we are now. walking through the jungle. This is we have a fine species right in front of us. <laughs> so I guess from here, you're gonna hike all the way up. Ooh, no trespassing. So here's where the trail starts. You gotta start your hike here. It's looking good and very excited. I mean, that's a good way to get your trip started in El Nido, isn't it? Like, trip to the beach first. We haven't even had breakfast yet. <laughs> down here, do the canopy walk. Then after this, go look for something to eat. Yeah, let's go. I feel like I wasn't given the heads up for this. <laughs> well, you know now. <laughs> All strapped in right now. Here's our main man, our guide. What's your name, brother? Alvin. Alvin. Alvin's our man looking after us today. Alvin, thank you. Yeah, thank you. Let's go. Oh, this is the first stop where you can stop, catch your breath, crack on, and the views here are already stunning. And this isn't even the highest point. I'm gonna stop talking and show you the views instead. Yeah. Look! Oh my gosh. I'm gonna keep I am a loving and leader already. Woo! Look at the views. <sighs> that is so that is blooming gorgeous. Wow. I mean, it's not the easiest track to navigate, I'll be honest. Because You've literally got like two metal rods here as steps. So, uh, multitasking is a bit challenging. <laughs> it's looking like we've almost made it. It's a little tight squeeze coming up now. That's why I was saying earlier, you do need a certain level of physical fitness to actually navigate your way around here. Cause... Oh, yeah. Wear your trainers. So today's the first day we've gone with a sensible choice of footwear. All right, we've made it to the top and the views are stunning. All of that grind, it was well worth it, cause look at this. This is what we're walking on right now, by the way. Just to let you guys know. It is uh, pretty sketchy. If uh, any of this gives way, then uh, it's, uh, it's gonna be a tight squeeze down there as well, and a painful one. But don't let that distract you from this gorgeous, amazing view over El Nido Beach. The wow. best viewpoint I think we've ever seen. We, we love, love El Nido! Nido. Wow, you guys, these views are insane. So we were talking about all of these bankers down here. These are all getting ready to leave for day trips. Um, but we cannot recommend this canopy walk enough. If you are 
come into El Nido, make sure this is one of the first things you do because you get the most incredible view over the bay and over the town of El Nido. It's a little, little town. It's not even very big, but it's so beautiful, so quaint, so quirky. We love it, but wow. El Nido is, yeah, we're impressed so far. It's love. El Nido is living up to its height that everybody has told us, everybody oh, yeah. has recommended. We 100% agree with all of those recommendations. It's exceeding expectations. Yeah, it is recommended to be one of the most beautiful islands on earth and so far. With one of the most beautiful beaches as well. So. Yeah, with the most beautiful beaches and so far I'm in agreement. Yet to have seen some of the beaches, but hands down, it's this is doing good. it. It's looking good. Yeah. Okay, we're gonna head back down now, so let's go. So you guys, after that grueling activity this morning, these chairs <laughs> needed some cooling down. We needed a refreshing drink. So we came back to El Nido Beach. We've come to Athena Cafe. So we have an avocado shake and a calamansi crush. And mm, they are, mm, I couldn't wait to take a little sip of the calamansi crush. These treats needed a cool drink. Oh, that is so good. So refreshing and like, Beautiful views to top it off. What more could you want? Look at that. Rousing. Now I don't mind having these drinks with a beer like that. I've never tried avocado shake in my life. No, Neither have you. No. Oh, we forgot about the brownie, by the way. We oh, forgot a brownie. Yeah, and we have a brownie. Not bad. We're down to our healthy habits of having amazing <laughs> breakfast again. Yes. Yeah. Healthy would be avocado because that's a fruit, right? So that's the healthy bit. We've got a brownie because why not? We deserve that because we overworked ourselves first thing in the morning. So we deserve some dessert. Yeah. See you guys in a minute. Okay, so you guys, we've finished our healthy and nutritional breakfast and we are now just gonna walk back up through the town, go hop on our bike and head to the next destination. We are here at Napapan Beach and this place is beautiful. Like it is so nice. This beach is absolutely huge. Wow. <laughs> like you walk down and it opens up so much. Like you don't even expect this beach to be this wide, this yeah. long. Like I'm just going to show you guys quickly what it looks <laughs> like. Look at all of that. Look at all of that. No one's here so far. Wow. This is the widest beach in the Philippines that we've seen so far. And look at the views here. The tiny little island there, there, some bits there, some over there, but wow, the views are stunning. This is gorgeous. Palm trees and a beach is literally the perfect setting for me. Dick. Should we check the water out? Let's check the water. Oh my gosh, you can see how clear the water is from here. Oh yeah, I'm taking my footwear of choice off. Crocs, Crocs, if you're watching, collab. <laughs> oh my days, look at this. Oh no. no. Wow, no seaweed, no shells, oh my no my pebbles. God. It's literally like you're walking on a carpet. Oh my gosh, this is sick. This is insane, this is so beautiful, you guys. This puts the dictionary definition of crystal clear water. Wow, I love it already. Can we just stay here in Nakpan yeah. Beach? Just stay here forever. <laughs> Nakpan, we're already loving it. We've only wow. been here, what, two seconds? Yeah, this is so nice. We've literally just got here two minutes Holy and we're loving it. Oh my lush. gosh, look at this water, guys. <laughs> There's no pebbles no stones and it's literally like you're walking on a plain surface like a nice little carpet oh this is sweet love it you guys first impressions of el nido kick it's a big thumbs up from us we are already obsessed Nightpan beach is only a 25 minute drive from el nido town so we drove straight here the road is a little bit tricky at times but the majority of it is all fine, so other than that, it's all good, but... 
We're here, we are loving it, and El Nido is freaking beautiful. Guys, cue the drone shots. We have just put the drone up. You guys have seen the shots. This place is so amazing. Like, we are so excited to be here. Do you know what? I'm even gonna go as far as saying, this is by far, wait for it. This is by far the most amazing beach that we've ever been on. I thought it was gonna take a lot of doing to trump beaches in Thailand. Unfortunately, for people in Thailand, this is it. El Nido, we see what everyone raves about when they're like, you need to see the beaches in El Nido. And, they uh, are insane. Wow, I feel like all I've said is wow, or <laughs> amazing or beautiful, but honestly, wow. <laughs> like, quite literally, like this is such a nice white sandy beach. The water is literally crystal clear. Like, Wow, uh, oh. and for me what does it is how wide it is it's so nice and the blue there's islands all around well islands 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 everywhere and it's white and sandy and it's all palm trees all around wow guys if you look up perfect beach in the dictionary nat Clam beach is going to be numero uno we <laughs> love nat Clam beach so now it's time to get in the water because my feet have burned. The sand was hot, it but was. it's a beautiful day to be on the beach. Do you know what? We heard before we got here that the weather in Lido wasn't amazing because it's the, the rainy season that started, but there's nothing but glorious sunshine and blue skies, baby. Well, Neck Fan Beach in El Nido is the best beach, hands down, that we've yeah, visited. Absolutely. It is so stunning, it's so wide, and the sand here is literally white powder. Mm. The water is clear. So nice. And it's just amazing. Like, it's like, wow, it's incredible. Like, yeah. it is literally incredible. We love it here. When you're on a beach, you're gonna go for something tropical, and we're going for this is the first time we've seen this drink coconut rum. Let's go, brother. Let's do this. I need drink first, I need two space for the rum. <laughs> yeah, because I didn't drink much. Mm -hmm. How is it? So we're getting coconut and rum. Never seen that before, so we're going to try it right now. To cut it open, there we go. 
That's all the good stuff going in. <laughs> Taste test it. Are you ready? Yeah. We're going to see if it's uh, strong enough. <laughs> It's still very coconut. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna be on the floor in a minute. It should be good now. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, I can feel this. <laughs> <laughs> it's good though, huh? Oh yeah, do you want to try it? First ever time that we're trying coconut and rum. This is so sick. Because it's obviously full of coconut water. You've got to drink some of it to make space for some rum. You got some rum going in, they'll ask you to taste test it if it's to your liking, if it's not strong enough, they put more, they top it up. <laughs> Tell us what you think. It's too strong. That's strong. That's really good. Thank you, brother. What's your name? Uh, Kim Ji. Kim? Kim Ji. Kim Ji? Yeah. Kim, you're a G. Thank you. Doggo, what's happening? Doggo wants some uh, coconut and rum as well. <laughs> <laughs> All right, shall we? Let's do it. That's the beach there. This is where we got our coconut from. This is where we sit in here for lunch. How amazing is that? You don't have to travel too far down there if you want to get something to eat. There we go. So, that is the normal coconut without any goodness in it, other than coconut water, of course. This is the one with the real deal. Like, it's got the good stuff in there. Yes. Yes. <laughs> mm. um, we are just going to leave Nakpan Beach now and we're going to head on to our next spot for today. Um, right, so we've just got to Las Cabanas Beach. Ring There's Libby trying to ring out the t shirt because we've been absolutely soaked in rain, but that's not going to stop the party whatsoever. That's not going to get in the way of us having a good time. Las Cabanas Beach is generally known for its amazing sunsets. People come here in the hordes and the dozens to come see the sunset. However, the weather is, uh, is uh, not so much favorable to uh, sunset conditions right now. I'm not sure if there will be a sunset here today. Look at the landscape though. Oh my gosh. Have you guys seen anything like this before? What on earth is that? Wow, I've never seen a limestone cliff that close to the beach, like to the beach. It looks like something out of this well, like this is so beautiful. Wow, like, look at that. That's another island that you can like um, walk to right now because the sandbars out. El Nido, you are doing things. Literally, we heard so much about beaches on El Nido and people were like, you have to go, you have to go. They've been rated as one of the best in the world. And we can see why. You guys weren't exaggerating. It is for real. This is our new favorite place in the world that we've been to so far. In El Nido. In El Nido, yes. This is what we've heard, so we're here. We're Everyone's waiting. recommended it, literally. Okay, so you guys, we have just seen the most incredible sunset. It was 
beautiful. We've just gone back to the hotel, showered and changed, obviously, because we were a bit sweaty and sticky from the sea. Um, and from now, everything, basically, well, all yeah, day today. Everything. It's been a long one. It has. So now we've come for dinner, and um, we've come to Happy Home Restaurant on Beach, on El Nido Beach, and it is. Mm. But we have had the most incredible day. Our first impressions of El Nido have been insane. It has far, far, far exceeded any expectations and all of the hype. It is worth it. We highly, highly, highly recommend. El Nido has to be a place on your trip when you come to visit the Philippines. If you have enjoyed it, then please do consider subscribing. Drop us a like, drop us a comment, and we'll see you guys in the next one.